Now, to the People's National Congress now, and the party has been holding its Congress. Uh, as we speak, that Congress is ongoing, and uh, the Congress is to elect its flag bearer for the 2020 presidential election, and also national executive officers to steer the affairs of the party. Well, 30 aspirants are battling it out for 14 positions, including the flag bearership, Reverend Samuel E.J. Deborah, uh, Asaki Samson Awingobit and David Apasera are contesting the flag bearer position. I am the only candidate who says that the MPP government in 2017 abolished VAT on abortion. Now, in Ghana, or the, that's the, the Greater Accra here, PLC delegates who are here, how many of them, if you take the Ramona out and take the Obama out, and maybe some few in national executive, how many of them are here, maybe the recognized chairman and others, how many of us here join play? But how many of us do not, are not taking structure or taxes to work? So I would rather abolish a VAT on petroleum products and rather reintroduce VAT on a basis for the rich people to jump right because they want to quit to work for or Tamil and come back, pay more and we tax to divorce this country. So I will say that. The MPP government abolished VAT on real estate and said it was a for them. It's, it is a mispriority for uh, my policy. I would rather, because how many of us here can buy estate in this country? So I know estate is being bought by rich people. And so I would rather introduce VAT at re on real estate for the rich people to always buy in our thousands of the country and rather abolish VAT on cement for the ordinary people gathered here to vote today to enjoy the next leader of the party to be able to buy cement and because they have the piece of land and can put up a decent room and stay there. I am the only candidate who says that if I come, because I realize that I come from a business background, I realize that. By our GRPC law, if you are a foreigner, you are coming to the country, you enjoy five year tax holidays. So that's one of the presidential contenders, Samson Awingobit there. The National Delegates Congress is ongoing in all the regional capitals. Voting, uh, voting will end at 3 p.m. and the winners will be announced at 5 p.m. We'll bring you more on this in our subsequent bulletins. And just before we go, we just have uh, to remind you that this is your election headquarters. Seeing as uh, you are so interested in election-related news, uh, we have decided... Uh, management of Joy News has decided to extend election brief by 30 more minutes. So from October 1, that's tomorrow, election brief will be one hour from 1.30 to 2.30. So that's a wrap for today's uh, edition of Election Brief. Sports Today is up next. Remember to join us same time tomorrow.